Hello guys, it's Shaq with PvP's here, and we all know the notorious creature of Minecraft, mobs. They always get in our way, and it's so hard to fight them. But today, I'm going to be going over some of the best ways to fight your troublesome, troublesome mobs. So, I have on me this diamond sword, as you can see here, and this bow. I will be using these objects um, in this video. Um, and I'm going to go over my best strategies for fighting mobs. Sorry, just gotta shift the camera a little. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoy this video. I know it's not going to be the best video you've ever seen, but hey. Um, so I'm just going to pick up some more arrows here, because as you can see, my weapon is the bow. And so arrows are the important than arrows here. No here, no, but I'll be killing skeletons, so it doesn't matter. Um, so without further ado, let's get tonight, and I'm going to be going over the strategy to kill mobs. And this is going to be a regular night, as you can see, say the time of the night. It's going to be a regular, everyday Minecraft night. And we're going to see. Um, and I'm just going to go over my legit strategy, as you can see it tonight. No mobs, just if you're playing for adult Minecraft. And yeah, it's just so if you're going about, um, if you saw the enchantments I had my things, and at the end I'll probably go over. So here we go. So some of the since the creepers here, um, I'll go. So my strategies, what I like to do with creepers is so you can just walk through them, and they'll actually just explode if you walk away from them. Um, so yeah, one of the most pesky creep creatures in Minecraft I to really do is walk through them and shabam. They are down to the count. Um, so I still wait for more mobs to appear. My gosh. So spiders, honestly, um, really for spiders, the best thing to do is first have to get rid of this creeper. Just go throw it there. You can explode if you want. See, another thing I like to do with creepers is just, so another thing I like to do with spiders if you if you can outrun them, um, I get some building blocks as you can see. I just like. Building up a tower. And but spiders can climb, right? But you can just knock them off your tower. And it's real easy, especially if you're in a horde. Um, and since my sword is not back, is it that hard? Oh, they have the zombie. Because zombies, honestly, I have no good stretch for them. It's just good to light them up. Um, but really after that, it's not that big. Another strategy with creepers, like, the one I usually use, is I get away that I shoot them. I can just show that off. Shoot, and it's just easy because they're bad mobs, and I don't like them that much. But yeah, so I shoot them away, then they're done. They're, they're over, they're dead. They're, like I said, zombies, just light them up. Oh, and here's a skeleton. How do you deal with a skeleton, you may ask? Well, I know they get really close, and I start chopping at them. Some people like to go bow on bow with skeletons, but honestly, you're not going to beat them at their own game. It's just going to be a lot harder. If you get up close, they're definitely not the close-up type. It doesn't help that I'm not back because I sent them back so they have arrow room. But hey, what you going to do about it? So, yeah, just get really close to the stabbing. Sorry about that. Stupid, not able to have a screen recorder. See this skeleton? See, if you try to fight them far away, they'll hit you as equally as much as you hit them. Obviously, I have an enchanted bow, so it makes it a little easier, but it's still quite bothering. There you go, the creeper. Probably can't see them, but hey. Shoot them, and sometimes they'll survive. Obviously, sometimes they're not. Helps if your bow's enchanted. And yeah, just bite them away. Because I am titanium. I'm surprised that they're lasting so long. They usually go down. Easier and faster. Let me just collect my arrow. Um, but yeah, just snipe away on creepers. Oh, snipe the spider. Die. So yeah, and I know there's some other mobs I have yet to go over, but hey. Um, I'm pretty sure I saw a slime somewhere earlier. And honestly, for slimes, um, I don't have the time or the time to demonstrate, but what I do is just... Build a little float or water all around it, and then, yeah. And if I could, Enderman, please, Endermans. 
There seems to be no Enderman who wants to show up tonight. Come on, Enderman. I'm never shy when I'm not making- Oh, there, there it is. But I have to find a close by body of water. Because when I didn't kill Enderman is, you straight up are so clear in the eyes. It doesn't matter as long as there's a body of water nearby. And there it is. So you look clear in the eyes. Get the real man. Get the- just look at them. Just look- just, hey! Hey you! I'm looking at you. Then, you see which direction they're at. And you sw swing at them and try it as it go to the water too. It helps. Honestly, I like staying away from the edges. Uh, but if you just keep on looking at things in the eyes, it will keep on coming back. And it's just really funny uh, because there really isn't that much. Um, I can't, I usually kill them before. I have killed them before with this method. Uh, but this one's being stubborn. It's probably waiting anyway. That's enough of that. And as you can see, creepers keep a distance from them because they are so annoying to fight. I try to walk through them, but that usually doesn't end the best for me. I don't know. It could just be kind of back up to you. I can see it. Uh, was, ah, man. Cave okay, did not see that. Well, hi, bad. And also for zombies, just a quick alert if you keep your volume up really high, you'll hear them! Stupid creep. I'm out of here. Great! So I'm just have to slice and dice you up. You can blow up. Also, if you don't heard of mobs, honestly, it's not the worst thing if it blows up, because honestly, just don't be directly in them, or else you'll go flying straight up and it'll be terrible. Anyway, if I could find- ooh, Enderbutt. Not gonna fight the Enderbutt. 